work, right? It just doesn't work really well. Doesn't mean that these aren't gonna be bad pizzas. Doesn't mean these are gonna be bad pizzas. I'm just trying to bump the catalog today. See, I can't watch cooking. I can't watch cooking competitions. I can't do it. I've been asked to be on every cooking competition in the freaking world besides Top Chef. I'm not good. I'm not that good. And uh, that's the only one with like talented, like real talented chefs, you know. And uh, I just can't get into it. If I can't make eggplant and black pepper, black pepper jokes. <laughs> Yeah, see how this is stretching nicely. It's just gonna change the flavor a little bit. Now the dough's starting to warm up. Now the dough's starting to warm up. So now we can stretch. So maybe it was just the temperature of the dough, but you guys see how nice and evenly this is stretching. You can actually do the, before it flipped off my hands, I was about to say I can do the pizzeria toss with it. That means it's ready, All right? So now we're at the right temperature. I would tell you guys what temperature this is, but I can't because my thermometer was stolen. We're at the right temp now. Cutthroat Kitchen? I never really got to see much of it. I love Alton Brown. I just don't like cooking shows. I've just never been into... Have you guys noticed, right? The Food Network is now all travel. And then the Travel Channel is all food. Oh, this dough is looking beautiful now. We're there. Chef's Table is excellent. Next chef's table pizza season, salt appearance? Maybe, maybe. I did meet with some people from chef's table. It has nothing to do with me about being on it, but I met with some people from chef's table a couple months ago. It was cool. I don't know what's gonna happen, but uh, the first thing we need to do is get our Gosney dome in the driveway. You guys, I don't know if you guys saw the thing that I posted about Facebook. I don't know if Annie Jay's here and still has it. But well, we're gonna start a little Tuesday thing, making pizzas. Instead of doing a stream here, we're gonna set up a pizza restaurant in the driveway. 24 ball doughs of, you know, 24 balls of pizza dough, maybe 32, and just go until they're gone. <laughs> just go until they're gone. That's how we're gonna start. All right, I'm going down with the sauce here. So this is our seafood pizza. No cheese, not right now. Maybe a little parm on top. But we're gonna go a little bit of sauce here. We're gonna spread it around. That's just gonna be our streams, all right? That's gonna be our streams. Testing out our Nove concept. This is something for like 10 years in the making, you know? Who knows how long? Chili oil, our Calabrian chili oil. This is supposed to be a very spicy a pizza. So this is all we're putting on it. Look how beautiful this pizza is. You guys see how the dough is ready to go? Bro, this, uh, this uh, Marzano is US sauce, or I'm just trying. This is United States tomatoes. Very good high-end United States tomatoes, okay? You don't have to buy this brand. You can buy any reputable brand. Cento is good. Okay, Cento is pretty good. I did some work with Cento in the past, right? I like Cento tomatoes. Just use what you like, but the only thing is salt and tomatoes, that's it. All right, so we're gonna go in with our plain pizza base. This one is gonna have a more traditional look, I promise, come with me. I gotta change this music though, it's driving me fucking nuts. I feel like the same slow ass mopey song has been on. I'm trying to get hype in this chat. This is a little more hype music. That other shit was putting me to sleep. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go in. This is by far the best.